The sheer scale of the challenge of cybercrime is far greater than anybody ever imagined before. People are using their mobile phones to make transactions. People are on the web buying things more often than they ever were before. 93% of all money is digital. So that's what's at risk. It's difficult uh, because as technology increases on our side, technology increases on the bad guy side as well. I don't have to go out and break into an ATM. I can do this from behind a computer. So what we're seeing is this great increase in terms of transnational crime online. The answer to this problem is ultimately not simply a public one. It is a public-private partnership, and Microsoft is at the core of that solution. Microsoft is game-changer in terms of the fight against cybercrime. It's vital that we have a set of relationships where people can come in and work together and not work at the speed of government or even at the speed of business, but at the speed of cyber. Now we're able to go on the offensive in a completely legal way using civil litigation action uh, with Microsoft resources. We're able to work with Microsoft and make really lasting, impactful change by taking down things on a much larger scale. So what we will see, hopefully, is that we will see more takedowns in coordination where Microsoft has the muscles and insight. We will follow up. So we will not just take them down, we'll actually also utilize the knowledge to see if we can catch the perpetrators. If we try to build the present in the image of the past, we would miss out entirely on the challenge of the future. Because of companies like Microsoft, and the Digital Crimes Unit, more is being done today than has ever been done in history. The work they're doing is, is really heroic, and I, I believe it represents enormous hope for the future. Our goal is to take new steps forward to really ensure that it's a lot harder in the future for cybercrime to pay off.